this is you when you're 19 years old and pretty damn happy about you know this is you 19 hi <laughs> so here is my little letter to you you're currently in in middle school or public school and in grade seven or grade six and you're feeling really nervous about the next step of your journey you're probably thinking to yourself am i going to make it to high school am i going to have a new beginning with some new friends am i gonna am i gonna start this new year off right or and is this all going to go to a waste and the answer is it's never going to go to a waste continue to hang out with Brittany and brianna they'll be with you every single step of the way but surely that relationship will come to a close because guess what <laughs> you're moving <laughs> you're moving and you're gonna start high school very very soon and there it's gonna be the best experience of your life four or five years you're gonna be in high school or not in five years but you're gonna be in high school for four for four or five years You'll meet some of my some of your favorite people in the world, which include teachers, parents, and including your friends, who are the funniest and most awesome people you could ever hang out with. To know that you could should never ever care about being popular. I mean, come on. I'd rather be an underdog than stay and then be at the social hierarchy and be the most popular person ever. Just be who you are. Never ever doubt that. So people that are making fun of you still, I hope they go away soon because honestly, it's going to stop. It's actually going to stop very, very soon. And also, you're going to be having this new newfound confidence about yourself. You might dye your hair in green nine just as an experiment. It will work out and you'll die for many, many times. But you'll also know that in the future, everything gets better for you. You're not going to be this social, this like very social conscious or you're not going to be shy at all. You're going to be turning into this gorgeous, gorgeous, beautiful woman that you are right now. You are going to let yourself in a whole new light saying that I can do this. I can reach that level of being great and being who I am and to finally say that I can get a 200 in bowling. Yay! You'll get your first 200. It'll feel great. But you know what, it's gonna be coming to your, you know what, your relationships are gonna count most to you. There's someone that's gonna pass away and it's gonna hurt you not only emotionally but physically. Um, you're gonna have some relationships that are gonna last you for the most longest as you can possibly take them. You're also gonna meet some new people along the way. Like I said before, friends, family, teachers, all that jazz, but also when you reach the level of going to college, which I'm currently right now, you will meet some of your favorite people ever. People that make you laugh, smile, and care about yourself and to accept yourself in a whole new limelight. Not only that, you're gonna show people who you are. You know what? If you don't like me, then kindly go away. <laughs> That's the nice way to say that. Also, on that awesome high note of starting off your life brand new, you're getting your first tattoo. Well, you, you can't see right now, but it's like, it's right there. It's right there. <laughs> and it's gonna represent something that means close to you. And you're never ever gonna take anyone for granted. You're also gonna get, you're also gonna get a piercing. It's a nine row piercing. It looks so cool. Also, you know what? To start off your, your brand new you, I should tell you this, you're going to college. I mean, I'm saying that that C word girl, I'm saying the C word, it's college. You never would have thought you would make it to college, but the grades in high school that you got drove you to your point where I'm gonna go, where you applied for a college, got into all three program choices, and ended up in a, in a career path which is gonna take you farther than you would ever expect it. Also, I have some advice for you. Don't ever, ever, ever pretend to be someone who you don't want to be. Don't pretend to be the girly girl. Don't pretend to be the tomboy. Be who you are. If you want to wear all black, then go right ahead because that's what I did and it looks, I look pretty cool. <laughs> you know what? Listen to whatever music you want to listen to. If you don't like the Disney crap that you're listening to right now, then kindly get into bands that are inspiring. Bands that 
drew a fire in your soul to give you that courage to believe in yourself. Also, you know what? It's a pretty cool thing to, to move and to have a new experience behind you. Um, Adam, your brothers are going to be with you every single step of the way. Grandma and Grandpa will be there too. Mom and Dad will 100% be, be there with you and never, ever, ever stop believing in yourself. You're a lot stronger than you think. Just be strong, because I know you are. And to never, ever, you know, like I said, like, don't stop living yourself. And uh, You don't know where life will take you. But in this, in this case, I know where it's going to take you. And I hope the career path that you chose will give you that stepping stone in life to where you want to be. So, thank you. That was Dear Me. And... And that's all the most awesome advice I have for you right now. Thank you so much for watching my dear me. And I have had so much fun filming that video for you all. So if you like that video, go ahead and like it. If you want to go ahead and subscribe, go right ahead. Because there's going to be more videos like that for you to watch. And yeah, that was it. You know, want to follow me on Twitter at Emily Jodry just to see what else I tweet about. And it's so much fun, trust me. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.